Cecilia Estolano. Uh, I'm with Estolano Lazar Advisors and also the Better World Group. Uh, former CEO of the Community Redevelopment Agency of the City of Los Angeles back when there was redevelopment. Um, and a longtime planner, land use lawyer here in Los Angeles. And we're supposed to look forward. So we've done a lot of looking back. Um, and this is our opportunity to look forward, but you can't really look forward without understanding what's really happened in, in the past. So we're gonna start off with um, um, Alan, I mean Christopher, um, is gonna, it's Christopher Alexander, who's a principal of CJA Creative Collaborations, is gonna show some visual representations of what our urban form, how it's changed over the last 150 years. And he's gonna tell you more about it, but that's gonna be a nice frame for us to talk about moving forward into the future. Thank you. Go ahead. Good morning. I'm honored to be here today and I'm very grateful to everyone here whose important work has informed and inspired me throughout the 18 years that I've lived in Los Angeles. Before launching my creative consulting agency four years ago, I was an architecture and design curator at the Getty Research Institute. When my colleagues and I began planning our exhibition, Overdrive, LA Constructs the Future, 1940 to 1990, the first thing we had to do was convince the museum that this was a worthwhile project to feature in the Getty Center's art galleries. Before we showed them images of the beautiful drawings, photographs, and models we hoped to include in the exhibition, I knew that I had to clearly explain how this vast metropolis was different than other cities and reveal how LA was able to transform from this in 1935 to this in 1955. So I created this diagram illustrating how the polycentric city of LA grew over time. It was wonderful to see how colleagues of all backgrounds quickly became excited about highlighting the region's evolving planning strategies and ambitious infrastructure networks, in addition to its eclectic public architecture and innovative residences. My goal was to develop a refined version of this animated diagram, which would introduce our diverse visitors to the complex LA landscape as they entered our first gallery. We'd previously collaborated with uh, USC professor Phil Ethington on our first Julius Shulman exhibition at the Getty, and I was familiar with his work on the HyperCities Digital Mapping Project. My colleagues in the Getty Museum's Digital Media Department and Exhibition Design Department and I were fortunate to partner with Phil, Adrian Amler, and Samuel Kruger on the development of two animated maps, which I'm happy to share with you now, and which will help set the stage for this panel's conversation. These videos are an important part of Overdrive's legacy, and I'm thrilled that teachers, scholars, and international fans of LA have continued to enjoy them on YouTube and the Getty's website.
Thank you.